trip. You trip. You tripping. You tripping. Boom. Boy. <laughs> 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 you on a diet. Skittles are good for you. Fred, you hear that? No. He's, he's cat napping. But no, Skittles are really good for you. Skittles are not good for you at all. What's wrong with them? They're a little, they're These little. are low fat Skittles, no sugar. <laughs> low fat sugar? Yes. <laughs> I have low fat Skittles, no sugar. <laughs> they got yeah. like two grams of carbs. Yeah, three grams of total sugar. It is candy, full of sugar. No, see those grapes? That's full of sugar. It's natural sugar. It's, That's made from a factory. Th this is natural sugar. I made these myself and just rewrapped it back in a Skittle bag. From a Skittle? Yes. <laughs> I'm you, serious. How do you do that? How do you make homemade Skittles? Yeah, how do you make regular Skittles? I don't have a fucking clue. You gotta have a machine, right? You got I got one? a machine at home. You got one of them? Yes. And I have a, a slushy machine at home as well. That's right. I make my own slushies. It's called a bundle. Sometimes they be alcoholic slushies. What? Why do they make alcoholic skills? No. Because, no. No. Why do you make weed skills? No, because I don't, I don't deal with weed. Oh. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Dan. So funny, and I'm back again with another video. You feel me? Um, before the video even start, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Go ahead and hit that bell so y'all get notified every time I drop a banger. You feel me? Um, as y'all can see by the previous slides, you know what I'm saying. Basically just got off of work, you know what I'm saying? Showing my, you know, my surroundings and the people I work with that are like crazy, crazy nuts, but love working with them, man. Um, this video today is basically another Q and A, you know what I'm saying? Um, I made a post on Snapchat, Facebook, uh, Instagram, telling people to ask me questions, what they want to know about the the YouTube, what's my plans for my YouTube and stuff like that. So that's what I'm going to be answering today. Um, I wrote them down. This is my YouTube journal. This is where I write all of my Q&As. This is where I write um, skits that I want to do, vlogs that I want to happen. You know what I'm saying? I keep it jotted down here. Um, but yeah, this is where I wrote all the Q&As because I'm actually using my phone to record this now. You know what I'm saying? So... I wrote them down on here, so I'm gonna be I'm be reading the questions off, and I'm gonna be answering them to the best of my abilities. You feel me? All right. So, um, yeah. First question: What does it mean to have success? That's the very first question. Um, it depends. It depends on how you're looking at it. Um, because some people can have success and it not really feel that way if that, if that makes sense but su success to me is being able to not have to worry about nothing it's like getting to that point where you have to worry about nothing no bills you know what i'm saying nothing no payment you know what i'm saying you just everything's paid off you're living living your life you're doing what you got to do that that's that's success to me getting is setting a goal for yourself and doing what you got to do to accomplish and reach that goal. You know what I'm saying? By any means necessary, which means you're doing whatever you got to do, basically, to to get to where you're trying to be. You feel me? 
second question. It's like a two part. It's like a two three part question to this one. What's your view on how things are in the social media world today? Does it bother you that people will always have negative things to say about you? Um, my view on social media now is is way different than what it used to be. Um, now with this question, I don't know if it's speaking specifically about YouTube itself or is it saying like Facebook, Instagram, you know what I'm saying and stuff like that. But Social media as a whole is not how it used to be. It's more, it's more crazier now. You know what I'm saying? I mean, YouTube, I mean, not YouTube, but social media used to be a place where you can just go and connect with others. Now, every time you turn on Instagram or Twitter, it's, 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 it's porn. Like that, that's literally all I see everywhere, bro. Only fans taking over. You know what I'm saying? Subscribe to my blah da da, all this stuff. Like that's that's literally all I see. Now for the second part is does it bother you that people will always have negative things to say about you? Not at all. Not at all. I take I don't take negativity to be a problem at all. I mean, see people gonna say what they wanna say regardless of what I got going on. I mean it's not gonna stop me. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna do what I gotta do regardless. You know what I'm saying? But once I'm up, they whole demeanor about me will change. You know what I'm saying? And they're going to be a fan. That's usually how it go. They're going to become a fan, regardless. Uh, Next question. How did you figure out it was your time to be next? I, I never have, honestly. I mean, I'm just, I'm just finally trying to put myself forward through it. I've been saying for years that I was going to get this done. I'm going to become a YouTuber. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to be uploading and stuff like that. I just feel like you're never going to get to where you want to be if you don't act on what you're trying to do. You know what I'm saying? So I felt like I had to I had to start somewhere. You know what I'm saying? I've always been funny. I've always made people laugh and stuff like that. I've always been that person. But I was, I was also that person that never did nothing with with his stuff, you know what I'm saying? So, I'm tr I'm trying to do better at it, and I know I gotta be more consistent with the videos and stuff like that because people want to see it and want to see it and want to keep going. That's that's my that's like gonna be my hardest thing is being consistent. You know what I'm saying? I mean, cause I work. You know what I'm saying? Once I get out of work, I'm too tired to do anything. But my thing is, why you why you getting off and you sitting down on your butt? You know what I'm saying? You can be up doing what you got to do to make it up out of here. You feel me? That's just how I look at it, for real, for real. All right, so number four, how do you deal with still working to provide for yourself, but at the same time, try to build your platform? Like I said, man, it's it's kind of difficult right now. It's the early stages. It's, 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 it's difficult. Only because, well, I'd be tired. So I wake up every morning at 4.30 in the morning to go to work, don't get off to around 2, 2.30. I come home, I'm drained. You know what I'm saying? I'm drained. So about the time I try to get in a YouTube video, you know what I'm saying? I got I to gotta edit the video. I got to try to put all my stuff together, you know what I'm saying? By that time, it's time to take a shower and, and go right back to bed. So my whole day is pretty much gone. I'm trying to get better with it. I'm trying to... I'm trying to get to the point to where I don't, I can just wake up and do what I love. You know what I'm saying? I can just wake up, turn on the camera, and just go about my day. That's that's the whole goal right there. I want to I wanna work for myself. I want to be able to move when I want to move. I want to be able to do what I want to do. And I want to be able to, you know, say what I want to say. That's it. That's all. Period. You feel me? <laughs> Um, another question. We all know it doesn't happen overnight, but how has the process of building make you feel? Have you ever gave up? Me actually doing these videos is making me feel like a hundred times more into it. You know what I'm saying? It's it's kind of hard doing it by yourself, though. You know what I'm saying? It's it's harder. 
it's harder to do stuff alone than having someone, you know, to build up with it. You know what I'm saying? But I'm working through it. You know, I'm doing what I got to do. I'm trying to drop these videos as much as I can. You know what I'm saying? I really don't be doing too much to be dropping vlogs, vlogs like that. That's why I'm always doing Q&As or I'm just throwing in little random stuff that I'm doing throughout the day. But, um, yeah, that's about it. Um, have you ever gave up? Yeah. I wouldn't say I gave up because I'm like basically just now starting. So I don't, I don't see it as giving up. You know what I'm saying? I see it as I'm just now trying to get to where I'm trying to get to. Basic, basically, I'm just just now trying to get to where I'm trying to get to. Um, yeah. So that's about it. You feel me? Um. Thank y'all for watching this uh, video. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. You feel me? It, it it costs nothing to subscribe to the channel. You feel me? Just subscribe. Hit that subscribe button. You know what I'm saying? And You feel me? <laughs>